New Age Tactical. All right. <clears throat> New Age Tactical back with another knife. We figured since that other one had that hollowed out blade, we'd get Gerber another shot. Gerber was the one with the hollowed out blade, yes. right? <laughs> um, so this one here, we're kind of staying in the range now of just around 30 bucks. This was, I believe, 27-ish. Um, this is the F-A-S-T draw. F dot A dot S dot T. Uh, so it looks like three inch blade close length is 4.25. Overall length is 7.25. Weight is 3.5 ounces. Um, stainless steel blade textured nylon handle. It does come with the, where did I read it? Assisted 2.0 opening. So I don't know if that has a little spring built in or what. Um, let's get one of these bad boys open. You got a knife on you? Is that a brownie? All right. Um. Whoo. But it does have the safety on the side here. But it does have the spring, so it's pretty effortless to open. Um, part serrated, Tonto style. Um, not too bad for comfort. Does have the deep carry pocket clip. It's pretty comfortable. It's pretty light. Uh, it seems pretty sharp. This, this is actually kind of crazy because it doesn't have a thumb stud, but you could, I mean, the, the, the quick assist up here, but the lever, mm -hmm. but I mean, you can literally just touch that thing and it flies open. I wonder how, how that'll work pocket carry wise. Like if you hit that too hard, like no effort. Wow. Balance. Not bad. Not bad. Has a feel in the hand. It's not horrible. The clip's kind of in the way a little bit, but that's kind of seems like to be like a uh, a common thing now. Um, the handles. What what are the handles made out of? Nylon handle. I mean, they're real. They're real light. I mean, it kind of gives it like an almost cheap feeling, but not really. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's got thing. like, uh, I don't even, just a badass, like, taper. how it comes, yeah, taper. Like a badass taper to the tip. And it does, like, I know it's the tactical series. It looks, feels tactical, yeah, it looks you know tactical. what I mean? I mean? It looks cool if you're Batman. Um, <laughs> no, I mean, I, I like it. And the button's out of the way, at least. It is. It's not right where the thumb is. I just don't... That it, that opening's a little a little too easy. But let's give it a shot. That's a decent amount on the blade. It really looks like pubes on the blade. Oh, okay. Yeah. Good to know. That's pretty good. Yeah. It didn't go bald though. It missed a lot. I mean, the sharpness is there. It's just a small piece of blade to work with.
all disclosure to this is there's so little slicing force on this blade unless you come like all the way around which really doesn't happen and if you catch the charades then it just chews it up it's not that this knife isn't sharp like we saw when i hit it the couple times on the paper just the right way it slid right through the paper like it was nothing Yeah, it always hits the serrade. Yeah, I mean, it's sharp. It's just... Ready. It, it's not cutting through both like mm. the other ones have. Still a couple fibers were left. Yeah. yeah. If you use a serrated, it works. It does, yeah, well. serrated seem to kick its ass. Didn't even need to get to the serrated for that one. put a little bit of a rock into it it cuts right through like nothing I mean you just push straight down it cuts it but it leaves the nylon mm. if you put a little bit of a oop, little rock into it it cuts it clean tip as this kind of like a That did better stabbing the can than any of the other knives have done. Because of the Tonto. Infamous tip test. Did the tip already break? Hold on. I don't know when. So it just happened and we don't know when. I think it happened on the last one because I went into a knot. 
think I should hammer it in again? Hell yeah. We might as well. It's f***ed. Yeah. Let's see how thick the rest of the blade is. Three hits. One, two, three. Just pop the lock? Yeah. Yep. I don't know if that was just me getting better or <laughs> cutting or. So, closer inspection, this knife is pretty f***ed up. The tip breaking off, we didn't really fault it for that because it still did its job and even after the tip breaking off it cut through the bag like nothing. The problem is the safety failing. Um, it's the same reason as it always is, it's because there is like so much play that that safety is just not holding that spot anymore. So during the batoning, but I mean, and it goes like back and forth. So no matter what way you look at it, it's uh, pretty banged up. Um, overall, I kind of like the knife. I thought it was great. Like the way it looked. Like the way it handled, cut. Yeah, I'm gonna take this out into the woods, the baton. So it's it's not a bad knife. Which we do say that every time. But yeah, you get what we're saying. We're trying to make years of abuse happen in less than five minutes. I mean, the spring system still, still going. works we we've knocked how every knife has looked this is a good looking knife yeah i mean good looking knife it's a it's not the most comfortable but i mean it's not the most uncomfortable either i mean the last one left me with like cuts and blisters yeah um this one's not bad guys thanks for watching our video this is new age tactical hit that like and subscribe button um post in the comments we're gonna say every time what you want to see what you don't want to see what you think stupid what you think is good um, just so we can get better at this because the more we beat up the knives, the more we're trying to improve. Other than that, over and out.